Hey, VC. Von Groovers here back again. Uh, <laughs> put in another, another spotlight on again one of my favorite hip hop groups of the 90s, De La Soul. Again, they are re releasing their entire catalog on vinyl. Um, they have quite a few albums, but those very early albums were the ones that were most impactful and we all embraced wholeheartedly particularly those that love hip-hop music. Stakes is high. This is the album, I mean, they have Balloon Mind State, they have Grind Date, they have Me, Myself, and I, um, De La Soul is Dead. These are all great albums. Stakes is high, in my opinion, is probably their most important album. Maybe not as their most popular, but definitely their most important album. They had a, this is where everything really just came together. The sonics, the lyrics, and also they had a lot of true statements on this album. Um, originally De La Soul, they came out, they were kind of happy-go-lucky uh, guys. They didn't really get into it with other groups per se. It was just not even very political. They were always righteous group, but they were always just kind of fun-loving. This album, Stakes Is High, is the album that they really let those stakes be high. They really did their thing here. Um, lots of great songs on this album. Um, I, you know, I, I mean, I can just go through the list. My favorite is probably considered a more of a, a B-side track. Um, it's called Long Island Degrees. And obviously they are from Amityville, Long Island, New York. But basically the song is just about representing where they were from, but also kicking knowledge and wisdom. I mean, there, there are so many great tracks here. Of course, Stakes is High is up here, um, which of course is the title track. Um, I, I love this album. It's so easy. That's another big track on this album. And rest in peace to Dave Jalakor. He actually was the lead vocalist on that album. Now, in many De La Soul songs, Plug One, Pasta Noose was the lead, but Dave took the lead on that track, and it's probably, in my opinion, between Long Island Degrees and It's So Easy, probably the, the, the two best songs on this album. But I mean, it, this album is, is legendary. I wanted to share this with you. Um, beautiful album. Um, the Business, that's another great track that's on this album. My opinion, if you are unfamiliar with De La Soul or you kind of want to get to know about De La Soul, this is the album you want to get. Um, this is an unwrapping, as I mentioned. I'm just happy to get all of these albums. Some of them I have on the original release from a long time ago, but it's good to just get these fresh new takes. Again, artwork is legendary. De La Soul stakes is high. Wanted to share this with you again. If you are unfamiliar with De La Soul, I highly recommend. This is the album that you just want to dive into because this is really when they reached that crescendo. They, they, really, they really got it here, okay? Again, probably not their most popular album, but definitely their most important album. Um, there are several songs on this album where they, they made some statements against um, the the behavior of the, a lot of the, the artists at the time and you know basically pointing fingers to a degree um, and really focused on pointing out the ills of the industry at that time and trying to overcome them. Um, very good, very good album here. Again, De La Soul, Stakes is high. Again, rest in peace to Dave Jalapur, True, True Boy the Dove. Um, this is good music, y'all. This is, this is good music, all right? Again, wanted to share this spotlight slash unwrapping with you. You know, Vinyl Groovers, I always appreciate your time and you have a great day.